Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wokey, and I didn't get a video for today because I'm here with Genshin. I've just been super busy grinding it for go, so I'm just going to play some Genshin while I have some time down, now that it seems like I'm almost done with that. And I'm actually going to be exploring the new Izanami because I finally have missions to play here, so let's just do these dailies and see what they are. Um, I found the... I think her name is Catherine? Something like that? All right. Sorry about that. Someone stepped into the kitchen, so I had to stop everything I was doing. And now we can continue on. But if I suddenly... Why am I talking to you? Okay. Uh, if you suddenly don't hear me anymore, it's because I've turned off my mic. It's really hard for me to record, man. I think I've said it before. I only have very specific times I can record... It's funny how I'm like, oh yeah, new area. But also, I don't care what any of you have to say. There we go. Just have new stuff to do. I think, as a personal thing, I probably would like Genshin way more if I could skip all the story stuff. Or just give me... Like, I don't need the backstory, especially when they're gonna tell me this 5,000 times. All right. I have no idea what you said, but I alchemy can do it. Is this really just been me going back and forth, back and forth with these fucking dudes? I mean, if I read it, obviously it would be a little bit more, but... Uh-huh. Perfect. Transforms in a blade. Again. Alright, well this seems to have worked out perfectly fine. Congratulations. Alright. I sided with the writer, who is usually who I would go with. Good luck with your book, or whatever. And now let's continue on. Let's see, where to now? But yeah, if it was definitely me making Genshin, I would say... Drop all story dailies. Nobody cares about story dailies. They care about it once, they read it once, and then every other time it shows up, all they're doing is skipping. So it's actively a waste of time to make them. They should just be one-off quests, and that's it. And spend more time trying to come up with interesting... combat stuff. Such as not always having towers, because towers are not interesting anything, because all I can do is go right here. Yeah, they can't touch me. I'm like candy to them. Go here, destroy that. Ah, oh, see, they think they've got me because it's all the way over there, but... I have a bow and arrow, so I can just shoot it from far away. And they can just be destroyed. Your, t your tower is come crumbling down. Alright, later dudes. And I don't even need to talk to them at all. <laughs> it's a very, like I said, focus more on things that are actually fun to do daily. I don't mind doing the, the ones where you have to actually fight, because I'm like, okay. The unfortunate thing is that it's always like, hurt your lurks or whatever the fuck they're called. Alright, let's go here. Let's see what's up here. Hopefully something a little bit better. Maybe an actual fight. Let's see. This looks like an actual fight to me. Maybe it's one of those to guard it for a set amount of time. Ooh, sabotage. I like sabotage way better. Destroy that. I actually think, um... Hu Tao is better at this. She's able to just massively do a lot of damage in a short amount of time. As opposed to Ganya, who is just like kind of sitting back and doing that. Right. Oh. Destroy, destroy, destroy. Come on. 
No, oh, you think you're clever because you're doing this, but you're not. They are now vacuuming. They literally don't do anything the rest of the day, and then they start vacuuming right when I want to fucking record. Uh, are you just gonna stand there? Or... You do anything, buddy? No? Are you gonna return here and heal? Sneaky. Can I hit you with the car? I can totally hit you with the car. Oh, it doesn't matter, because I can kill you way faster with this. Because now you're in the water. They stopped cleaning, so I was able to talk again. So let's go here. No. Thankfully, every time I've had to fight these samurai guys, they've been frozen solid, so I don't actually know how hard they are to fight. Uh, <laughs> because I just freeze them in place. So even with his giant flame and sword here, he doesn't really stand much of a chance against me. That guy tried though. A for effort, but doesn't really do anything when you're frozen. Alright, I'm gonna try and aim for your face now. Wow, really? He's not going down. I'm surprised. How did you heal? Come on, game. You're just angry that I was able to beat this guy so easily, now you're just giving him extra bonuses out of nowhere. That or I lost internet. Let's find out which what which would actually happen. So I have a feeling it's I lost internet. Let me see. I didn't lose internet. Okay. They just decided to give him an advantage for no reason. What? 
you were getting frozen and now you're not. This doesn't make any sense. I'm gonna assume it's because of all the lightning shit around you, but... You were also way lower on health before, so don't even try and act like you didn't just cheat your way. You, you don't deserve the Hu Tao you killed because I mercilessly put her out there. Let me give her some pancakes. Slap this around. Heal up a little bit. Go here. Heal up everyone. Nice and healy, healy, healy. And then I'll let Hu Tao get, get you down. Because you're also a giant lightning boy, so... You know who loves lightning? You! Alright. I forget. Hu Tao's constantly almost dying, so I couldn't, in good faith, bring her up, put her out there any much longer. There we go. I'll let Barbara kill you. I don't think she could kill you, but she can heal everyone else really quick. Alright, now you die. Out of my face. It was all a trick to get Hu Tao back out there. Do I get anything here? Doesn't really look like it. Nothing? Just two samurai dudes here hanging out on an island? <laughs> okay. Feels weird. Maybe I'll have to come back here another time. Well, let me see. There was just a whole bunch of treasure I passed up too. I'll remember to get it eventually. Let me see. Go here, I think. Thank you. Also, if you're curious, this is my uh, adventure rig at the moment. It's 55. So soon, I'll be able to get to 60. I was actually at 50 for a very long time, and then I decided to actually beat this quest, and now here we are. So that's the end of today's video, everyone. I hope you liked it. I'll see you guys in the next one. Sorry for the giant moments of silence, but it was either that or keep pausing the video and I have stuff to do today. So I wish you all the best and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.